Well, good morning, everyone. It is time for our Women's Care Wednesday segment where we are once again on location at Women's uh, Care Florida. This morning, we are joining you from one of their infusion centers, which is very unique as what I'm learning. Uh, this is Penny here. She spends a lot of time here, and I know you treat the patients that come in here like family. Mm -hmm. And let's talk about infusion centers because I really do think um, what you guys are doing here is so unique. And what I love when you walk in, it's the smiles. Again, it's, it's treating people like family. You don't feel like you're in a hospital room or an emergency room where sometimes it can be kind of stressful of what people are getting done here. Yeah. Well, uh, the idea of an infusion center is to keep people out of the hospital. Mm -hmm. Sick people are in hospital, and if they don't need a hospital care, it's best to keep them, mm -hmm. you know, in a nice environment like we have here. Not to mention that um, expenses-wise, it's a lot cheaper for them with mm -hmm. their insurance to come here as well. Oh, good. Mm -hmm. Talk about what it is that people are being infused with here. I mean, who are the patients that are walking in here? What different, um, you know, type of medical histories, you know, do you see? Yeah. Well, we see oncology patients. We do chemotherapy. Is it the most common? That's one of our most common. Mm -hmm. That's uh, pretty much where we started whenever okay. we opened. And uh, women's care uh, is of course based off of OBGYN. Mm -hmm. So we do see a lot of pregnant women. So in that aspect, we give them uh, hydration during nausea and vomiting periods during mm -hmm. pregnancy. And towards the end of their pregnancy, they might become anemic and so we can give them iron, which I feel is something that our doctors do proactively. I hear so many girls come in and say, well, I don't remember this with uh, <laughs> years ago pregnancy or some of my friends, but I feel like our doctors are being more proactive to make sure that they're more comfortable during their pregnancy. Yeah. Well, and it's interesting because women's care from what I heard and what I'm learning. I mean, it is a big team and it must be so nice for the doctors here and all the different specialists that your team offers mm -hmm. to be able to have somewhere to say, hey, yes, we have an infusion center right here yes. that you can go to. Well, we have right across the hallway. We have Eurogyne, we have oncology, gynecology, we have uh, GI, we have endocrinology. And if for any reason they need an infusion, be it for their endocrine system, if they need it for a GI issue, mm -hmm. or they just need some hydration, maybe after after your surgery to recover quickly. Mm -hmm. We can also help out with pain uh, control with uh, some IV infusions that'll help mm -hmm. the recovery period faster. Talk about the team here specifically too, because I know this is something that you and your fellow partners are so proud of that again, I keep going back to that term of you, you're treated like a family here because you mm -hmm. can tell um, the team here works mm -hmm. together as a family. Yeah, we do. We uh, we enjoy working with each other and I think that uh, we, uh, we don't assign a particular patient to one nurse when they come in. We work as a team and so we sort of read each other's minds and we know what needs to be done ahead of time and they're a step ahead of me and helping me out and it makes our work here become more flawless and so forth. The patients get treated faster and they feel um, more content with having everybody uh, taking yeah. care of them as well. Well, you hear so much when, when people are going through whether a medical issue or whatever, that mental is such a big part of it too. And when you know that you can bring people in here and they can feel comfortable, they can feel relaxed, it's got to help, I would imagine. I imagine it does. And um, I can attest to the oncology patients because that is my primary passion. I'm a cancer survivor myself. Mm -hmm. And whenever it's appropriate, I do share that with my patients and tell them that, you know, I've experienced your same fears and that yeah. helps alleviate some of those fears in them whenever they come in. Oh, I can imagine. Yeah. Well, as we get ready to wrap up here, what's your take home uh, when people are thinking about infusion centers and maybe looking at Women's Care Florida? And what do you want people to know about uh, kind of what you guys are doing here, your team is doing? We give a very comfortable environment. Uh, we take it out of the hospital setting and from the emergency room. It's better on your uh, pocketbook. Um, we make you very comfortable here. Mm -hmm. Pillows, blankets, we have snacks and drinks, and uh, we let you bring in things that make you feel comfortable. Your family can sit with you as long as they're under uh, over the age yeah. of 14. Yeah. Okay. Well, thank you so much, Penny, for allowing mm -hmm. us to spend some time here. Meet the team, mm -hmm. which, again, I know you guys are so proud of. We really appreciate your time. And, of course, to find out more info about Women's Care Wednesday, all of the segments, and, of course, Women's Care Florida, just head to our website as well.